Hey everybody, I'm Antonio Nakhchelfirevich. I'm the developer of QueryStorm as well as MondayLink. MondayLink is an add-on for Excel that lets you sync between uh, Excel tables and Monday.com boards. This effectively lets you use all of Excel's features on top of what uh, Monday.com already offers. I wrote MondayLink originally for myself while I was working on a project with a client who uh, worked a lot in uh, Monday.com. But I think it's a useful tool that anybody who spends a lot of time in monday.com and has uh, Excel on Windows uh, can uh, make good use of. So let me show you around. Let's start with this sample board for tracking bugs in a software project. The text entries might have been made in a hurry. They contain lots of errors. Let's see what we can do with MondayLink and Excel to quickly fix them across the entire board. I'll start by pulling the board into Excel as a new table. One thing we can easily fix are duplicate spaces. We can do that using the standard find and replace feature in Excel. We can also ensure that there are no spaces before and only a single space after each comma. This is a small sample board, so we could have done this by hand in monday.com, but if we had, let's say, a thousand rows, this could really save us a lot of time. If we pulled multiple boards into this Excel file, we could make the same adjustment across all of them at once. If we now save the changes back, we can see them in monday.com. And if we make a change on the monday.com side, we can pull the fresh data into Excel by clicking refresh. The links between tables and boards are stored inside the workbook, and we can see them by clicking the Manage Connections button. If we share the workbook with another person who has Monday link, they'll be able to refresh and save these tables as well. Another issue with the descriptions is that some of them start with the lowercase letter. That's not easy to fix with Find and Replace, but we can use Excel's Flash Fill functionality for that. I'll make a new column and fix one or two of the descriptions, and I'll let Flash Fill figure out the rest. I can now replace the original text with the fixed ones and sync the changes back to monday.com. The descriptions have other issues that aren't so easy to fix. There are capitalization issues, punctuation issues, typos, and quite a few grammar issues in general. These aren't something we can fix with formulas or other Excel functionality. But if we use another extension from the QueryStorm App Store called GPT, we can use the AI-powered prompt function to fix all of the errors for us. We can now replace the original values with the fixed ones and sync changes back to monday.com. If we were using the GPT package right off the bat, we could have skipped the earlier steps altogether and just let the prompt function tidy everything up. Another useful thing we can do with the GPT package is classify the bug reports in two categories user experience issues, such as pages loading slowly, and broken functionality, such as pages not working altogether. together. 
I describe the GPT package in much more detail in other videos on this channel. Links are in the description, so I won't go into more detail here. All right, so to summarize, with MondayLink, we can use Excel as our user interface for working with the data inside monday.com boards. This gives us access to all of Excel's functionality for working with data in monday.com. Specifically, in this video, we took a look at uh, uh, find and replace functionality, uh, autofill functionality, and using functions, and, and uh, especially AI-powered functions. In following videos, we're going to cover additional functionality that's very useful uh, for, for working with monday.com data. Specifically, um, we're going to cover uh, data visualization and data processing, as well as uh, using Power Query to fetch data into Excel and then to push it into monday.com. For now, I hope you've enjoyed this video. Um, if so, please leave a like and a comment and consider subscribing uh, if you're interested in more topics like this one.